there are three fundamental cadences in ternary. Depending the way they are combined inside the grooves, it implies one phrasing or the other. So it's very important to know them, to recognize them, to feel them. The first one arrives on the beat. Pana, 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 pana. The second one starts on the beat. Pana, 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 pana. The third one starts after the beat. Pana, 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 pana. I do it again. Arriving on the beat. Pana, 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 pana. Starting on the beat. Pana, 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 pana. And starting after the beat. Pana, 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 pana. If you hear the second fundamental cadence at least in one rhythm of a groove, this groove or this rhythm is a type 2 ternary. If you don't hear the second cadence, it's a type 1. Here are some examples of type 1 and type 2 grooves. There is no second cadence in this groove. It's a type 1. There's a second cadence, so it's a type 2. Again, no second cadence, so it's a type 1. And finally, yes, we can hear a second cadence here. So it's a type 2. <laughs> 